What is up homies, this is Rob the Vapor, a sleepy Rob the Vapor actually, who is not long awake, but uh, how are you all today, I hope you're well, I've been pretty good, and uh, we are doing a vape mail th uh, video today, I was going to say thread, I'm, I'm used to reddit too much, vape mail video, uh, we have sample box, and we also have envelope from sigreen.com. So we'll open this first. This is something I want to talk about a little bit because I'll talk about it more in this video um, and also in, in the actual product video too. But So basically this came about by discussing on the IRC uh, with another member there, I think it was Dumb Gecko. And we were just talking about like, you know, wouldn't it be cool to get stuff to review as opposed to actually buying it all the time, you know, because it gets expensive. And sure enough, I get a message off a guy on the forums and I didn't believe him at first. I was like, bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. So this dude was like, what can I do to make you believe me? And I was like, I don't know, dude. So he was like, go to this website. So I went to sigreen.com and uh, I still wasn't believing him. I went to sigreen.com and then like the customer support thing popped up saying, hey Rob, do you believe me now, blah, blah, blah. So that pretty much confirmed it for me. Um, but Super nice to just do it to send me stuff, so big props to him. It makes a huge deal to my channel to be able to um, actually do this stuff, um, you know, and, and, and get something to review where I don't have to pay for it out of my pocket. Because I also think not only is that um, better for reviews because you have no mon monetary value to anything, because if you pay for something, I feel like you might want to like it a little bit more. And then if you really don't like it, and there's no way of liking it, then you're going to hate it even more. So, you know, it's nice. So with that in mind, then, the first thing is what he sent me is the Orchid V2. Now, there is a V4 Orchid out already, but these constantly... I think there's a V4 V2. V4 number 2 or something already out as well. So, you know, I'm not too worried about Orchids being out of date. Um, I'm really excited to uh, try this out. This is an RTA. RTA meaning rebuildable tank atomizer as opposed to a rebuildable dripping atomizer. And this comes with its usual little thingies. It's actually an Allen key head uh, deck, I think. But it's an awesome unit. Yeah, I love it. It's got like frosted glass. Let's see if we can get a better view of that. Yeah, it's got like frosted glass and stuff. So we'll, we'll actually do a full breakdown of that in a different video. That's not for today. That's, you know, I don't know if I showed you guys already, but got me some Japanese cotton. All sent for free, by the way. And some Canthal. And some ghetto fast tech clones, or um, coils, sorry, that uh, are supposedly, quote unquote, to quote Chris from Sigreen, good for a day. So. <laughs> Let's uh, let's try them out at some point as well, for sure. And uh, what else have we got in here? Oh yeah, we've got a drip tip. Just a nice little simple drip tip. It's nothing too fancy. It does the job. I've, I've got plenty of them anyway. And a nice little micro coil jig, which I do have a jig, but this one is a lot better because it has the um, different diameters on it. It's just a simple, easy little thing. So a big shout out to Chris from SayGreen.com. You are the guy who's popped my uh, supplier cherry. In terms of sending me stuff to review, BA Vapes has sent me stuff before, but it was more so a bonus um, as it was something to review. So, big shout outs. I will never forget this great act of kindness. And uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to reviewing the Orchid. I'm going to build it as soon as this video is over. Probably make a video on the Orchid either next week or on the weekend. Today is a Thursday. Okay, sample box. Sample box. Look, new packaging. It's cool, isn't it? Okay, so guys, let me tell you a little bit about sample box because I've had a lot of people wonder. Sample box do ship to Europe. So if you guys want to try it out, they do. Shipping isn't exactly cheap. It's like fucking 20 euro. Or no, 20 dollars. So like 15 euro. I mean, that's not too bad for all the, the bottles, the different bottles of liquid you're getting. Because if you, if you were to break it down and say you were ordering one small sample from somewhere in America, you're going to be paying like 10 shipping, something like that, you know? 
So that's not actually too bad, really, when you think about it. Okay, so let's see. I'm excited. Example box, I changed my preferences to 12 milligrams this month. If it's not 12 milligrams, I'm gonna fucking murder you. Okay, okay. Oh, look at this. Oh, damn, son. Little record, share, win. I should be on them fucking pictures. Fuck those guys. Got indoor smokers, people tired all, tea of vapes. I don't know who that is, but I do know that I'm better looking than these three right there. So I need to be there. Right? Hashtag examples. You, you, what you do is you take a picture with your favourites. So, that's pretty cool. Robert, I think this is a Christmas card. This is the December sample box. And, uh, yeah, oh, look at this, look. Trinkets, woo -hoo -hoo. Um, okay, I'm not gonna read that, Tony. I hope it's an apology for the Atlantis. <laughs> um, okay, so we got all these cards, which I actually didn't get last month. Uh, sample box exclusive offers. Um, coupon codes, 15% off. Which is awesome. It's for, it looks like a new, new brand of liquid. Um, 20% off uh, MVPs and starter kits with uh, eVapor Hut. So if you guys want to check out eVapor Hut and use the coupon code Zamblebox, by all means, and Smoke and Mist have a 15% off. Smoke and Mist, I don't want you, I don't like you, and I hope that there's none of you in here. Woohoohoo! So, this is how the inside of the box is packed. Loads of little trinkets. Let's hope Tony gave me an extra bottle for Christmas there. But, uh, yeah, we'll see. Um, oh, yeah, so, okay, so the sample box comes packaged like that. Looks like we have no leaks. Oh, actually, we might have a leak. I don't know. My IRC is going crazy. Oh, no, we have smoke and mist again. <laughs> no, it's a different flavor, though. Different flavor. Okay, so this is awesome. No duplicates by the look of it. Just yet, anyway. No, no duplicates. So we have, I don't know what the fuck that reads, RLVNT Backstop. What the fuck is that? It smells um, almost like um, biscuity. Oh yeah, are these 12 milligram? Yeah, they are. Good job, Tony. Good job. Um... Smoke and Mist Butterscotch. Now I hated their tobacco ice, so I wonder will this be different? Those diketones in the butterscotch will be delicious, I'm sure. <laughs> I don't know if that smells too much like butterscotch now to me. I'll be polite though and check it out later. Um Okay. Ah, is this one no, this isn't the one that they Pumpkin Spice Custard. That does sound tasty. Zuka Moo. Fuck. Bon job and balls. Zuka Moo Pumpkin spi Spiced Custard. Now that sounds pretty interesting to me. Alright, this bottle doesn't even look like... Or this cap doesn't even look like it's on. Like, at all. Okay, here we go. Now let's see. It doesn't look like a leak, though. Whoa. There we go. <laughs> let's see. That smells fucking awesome. Pumpkin spice custard. That it's got the uh, nutmeg. That nutmeg spice almost. Awesome. I'm gonna read that. I love the smell of that. It's awesome. Um, hand off the goods. The goods. Hand off. Hmm. That almost smells like a custard too. Okay, interesting, interesting. So all, all together we've had one, two, three, four, f four, five, five bottles in one bag, and I think it's six in the other. Okay, um, Serpent Mild Guard Vapor. Serpent by Mild Guard Vapor. Tobacco. Oh, Jesus. Mentality tobacco, I think. I think. I don't know what the fuck that is. There's mint in there. That uh, smells like it could be okay, but it also smells like it might be dodgy. Right, here's the big bottle or the big bag, I think. So let's check out the 
Big bag. It's always nice getting these things. I've been waiting for liquid man. I've been running out using fucking 12 milli or 18 milligram. 28 days vapor. So this is another one by 28 days. Did I already get a bottle from them? No, I don't think I did. 28 days vapor. Uh, king's hand. The hand of the king. So let's check out this. Um, smells good. Um, butterscotch or something, maybe. Barrel aged, this shit is. So this is barrel aged. Okay. So sorry for all the Carson, by the way, guys. I'm half awake, so I'm not really on guard. <laughs> Uh, okay. Johnson's Creek. Johnson's Creek. You guys can see it. Smoke Juice Macana. If this is a tobacco I'm excited, there doesn't seem to be many tobaccos this month. I think, Tony, listen to me, man. If you've ever seen this. We need more tobacco flavored e-liquids, man, for sure. You're definitely, that's definitely the area where you guys are missing is tobacco. Big, big props for packaging. It's got a childproof cap. It doesn't have a dripper, but... Okay, um... Fruit. Pineapple. Um... Can't really get anything except for pineapple. It's definitely a pineapple. So... I'll try that out, actually, because I, I did like the pineapple juices I got last month, which I, I was kind of surprised by. Um... The Vapor Teeth Cut Off. Got some cool little logos here. Let's try it out. So Zambo Box isn't really for everyone, you know. The, if you're the kind of guy to order a Zambo Box and go, this is shit, I got all shit flavors. It's not for you. You have to go into Zambo Box with an open mind and you have to be someone who has a relatively open palate for liquids. If you don't, don't bother. It's not worth it. Dragon fruit, I think, or um, uh, passion fruit or something like that. Definitely. The vapor thief cut off. I'll check all these out in a while anyway when I'm done here. Oh, is this another? No. The bottles this month are really nice. Um, harvest three leaves. I'm going to say that this is a tobacco. Really nice bottle, Canadian and shit. Right, let's check this out. Yeah, yeah, I think that's the tobacco. It gives you the batch number and it's born date as well, which is awesome. So you know exactly when it's coming. Okay, and these ones are the ones I'm actually most excited for. Funnily enough, um, the the tobacco liquid that I um, vaped from them, or not tobacco, sorry, but the liquid I vaped from them, wasn't something that I uh, particularly enjoyed, but I appreciated that it was pretty well made. So I'm, I'm very excited to try these out, uh, because I, I did think that some of their brands would be awesome, you know what I mean? Um, what the fuck out there. Um, so, we have Nyx Swag, and we have Nyx Lush. Swag and Lush. Now, I'm, I'm excited for these. Let's try out Swag first, because these guys know they're really good. Okay. Best packaging out of all the sample boxes. Childproof dripper. That's the first to have a childproof dripper. Swag, eh? I don't know what that is. It's definitely a desserty type thing, though. Hmm, interesting. They're very Christmassy. I'm gonna that pumpkin spice. That smells awesome. Really does. And I and I don't really like pumpkin. I feel like pumpkin is like an American thing. Or maybe it started in somewhere like Germany. It's definitely not Irish anyway, put it that way. Okay, um Okay, this is um Nick's Lush. Let's see how lush it is. Fucking fuck. It's fruity. I don't know what though. I don't know what. I can't pick it out yet. I'm gonna have to let that sit with me. I, when you do this smelling of sample boxes, it does go to your head. You sort of lose all your flavors because you're just sniffing all these liquids at once. So that was it. 
awesome, awesome day for vape man. Big, big, big shout out to Chris over at Sigreen. I'm not shouting out Sample Box, I paid for it. <laughs> so, but yeah, shout out to Sample Box about this awesome stuff. Um, and yeah, I get the review of the Orchid that's going to be coming up soon in the next few days. And I might do a liquid review video tonight, maybe, possibly. I doubt I'll have enough time to spend with it. But thank you for watching, guys. I've been Rob the Vapor. Enjoy. Haters catch the vapors. Peace out, bitches.